I'm Chris Norton and uh, run a farm here in Redmond, uh, Western Australia. Uh, it's a family farm. We've been going uh, now, I'm third generation. I've got my son working with me as the fourth generation, so that's pretty special. We run 400 breeding cows. And we're about 50-50 Angus Murray Grey bulls. I think most of us see, have always seen pesty in our herd. Uh, originally, I, we would see one or two. The watershed moment was at the end of our selling season, I was left with 12 calves that were unsaleable. And we worked out the, 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 the cost that we were losing from that one year basically paid for the original vaccination. Because the first time around, you've got to give two. And then from then on, it's just the, the one booster annually. And I haven't seen those problems anymore. I don't see the dome heads. I don't see the, the birth defects, which pretty well proves that I had pesty and the vaccination program has worked tremendously well for us. But you only need one year like that where if you get 10, 15% not in calf, it's a huge economic loss. The management of uh, pesty virus is something that we've been doing for the best part of 12 years. It's part of our normal routine yearly vaccinations something that I just consider a normal part of managing cattle. We vaccinate all our calves at marking time and then bring them back in that four to six weeks later to give them their booster shots. A vaccination program is essential for any good herd. Sometimes we can get a little bit tight ass and don't want to spend the money, but it's definitely been a benefit for us to do it. It is definitely something that we're going to be using into the future. I don't think we can really afford not to use it. Um, we don't want to re-inherit the problems that we got rid of 12 years ago.